There was a person early in my life who was basically responsible for my starting piano lessons, if nothing else. He was a composer named George Kleinsinger, and he happened to be a friend of my parents. On occasion, my parents would go over to his house, and they'd bring me along, and George would play the latest song that he was working on. And I have no memory of this, but I have been told that after he was done, I would go over to the piano and start to plunk out the tune. And after a couple of these occasions, George said to my parents, have you thought about getting Stephen piano lessons? And in fact, getting him a piano. I had a really great experience at Juilliard Prep. I had a wonderful piano teacher named Santa Ojeda who was not only a good piano teacher, but helped me realize that I didn't in fact want to be a concert pianist and that I should maybe consider switching my area of concentration to composition. Aside from the obvious musical training that I got, and everyone knows that Juilliard is essentially non-parel, I think there were subtle lessons that were extremely valuable to me in terms of discipline, in terms of being serious about music and about what I was doing. I was surrounded by extremely talented people, including people younger than I, who were clearly <laughs> in some ways more gifted. Um, and I realized that it was a big talented world out there. And if this was gonna be my profession, I needed to take it very seriously, I needed to work hard, and I needed to put into practice lessons about um, all sorts of discipline and um, concentration that I was learning while I was at Juilliard.